Hello, I am David W. Parker. This is Programming Today I Learned, React Series, Episode 18. We're going to be looking at refs and the DOM today. So, <clears throat> suppose we have this custom input here, and we can have this focus method, and we have a text input here. And the text input is just a regular input uh, text field. Uh, there is an attribute that we can set on it, called ref, and that's allowed us to store the reference to the text input and um, use this uh, type of pattern as opposed to this dot ref dot my reference name. But it takes a function and it's passed into it, the actual uh, input itself, and then you could set this as a local variable on the instance within your custom input here. So we're going to set text input as a reference here. And then whenever we click focus, or we have the focus method uh, called, we're going to use the raw DOM API uh, of the input element in order to focus it. So we have a button here that says when we click it, it's going to call this.focus, which will in turn call this.textinput.focus. So we can see how that works as it loads that right there. Very simple, um, kind of nice. Uh, as you see in here, we have this autofocus text input in our app, and we can go ahead and load that. Now what this is going to do is we can pass the reference of the input here, and what it's going to do is we're going to have the text input, and we're going to have it, and when this is mounted, it's going to call the focus uh, method, which is right here. So because it's calling the custom input and it has the ref to it, it's going to say as soon as the text input, we're going to focus the text input. So when we ref uh, restart this, it's always going to be focused. Now, you might think that's great and all, but what if I have some pure function components? Uh, so we have that down here. So if we go down, comment this out, comment this in, and change those back, and then we restart it, you'll see that it still works. Um, we have to do a couple changes though. What we don't have reference to is this because there are no instances for a, the functional component. And so we have to have this uh, variable here so that we can have the ref callback for later, uh, which will be called here. And we're not going to have this obviously right here. You can use refs inside of the return statement within uh, functional components. However, note that uh, the autofocus won't work in this particular instance because it's trying to use the this. So that won't be working. Anyway, that's it for today's episode. Uh, if you like what you saw, please subscribe and check out my newsletter as well. Thank you much and have a great day.